It says that in the short space of time since this morning's announcement, the business community has pledged its financial support for the campaign effort. Absolutely. We have absolutely no doubt about that. In fact, um, just today, uh, since the announcement, we have heard from so many, so many people in the business community and so many other Belizeans uh, who are prepared to support the efforts of the People's United Party. And we've been working on that. We've been working on that uh, for the past several months. Uh, we anticipated, I think I have said it publicly, we anticipated that there would be an, an uh, election between October and March of next year. It's come at the front end of that um, period, um, but we are ready. And as I said, the Belizean people are ready. I am very, very uh, enthusiastic about the opportunity we have to serve the Belizean people, to form the government of Belize. Um, and the response just today has been overwhelming from people. I think people are excited. Um, people finally see an opportunity to rid our country of this UDP government. Um, and I think the people will rise up. And of course, we are calling on the Belizean people to do so. We need record numbers to come out uh, in this election. We need record numbers to come out and take a stand on behalf of their country, on behalf of Belize. Uh, if you are opposed to going to the ICJ, if you are frustrated uh, with the way this government has handled the entire Guatemalan issue, this is your opportunity to strike back. This is your opportunity to say no to the UDP. If you remember the Penner scandal, the immigration scandal, the corruption scandals at the Ministry of Lands, the corruption scandals in immigration, uh, the incompetence at the Ministry of Health taking place today, um, our failing education system, if you are feeling all of these things, um, you will have an opportunity on November 4th to do something about it. And that is our message to the Belizean people. We know you are frustrated. Uh, we know you're looking for hope. You're looking for a new opportunity to start uh, a new, to start the growth and, and development of our country again, moving in the right direction. And November 4th presents that opportunity. The rollout of the